What's up fellow builders, Builders Joe here, welcome to my channel. Hey what's up guys, it's your favorite Builder Joe, wishing you all a happy new year. Speaking about happy, I'm being sponsored by another company called Tempest, which I reached out to during 2019. So Tempest is actually a small company that sells keyboard for basically work and gaming purposes. Also because of this sponsorship, I'm able to have a hands-on review of this keyboard which I will be telling and also showing you the unboxing together with my own personal reviews. But before I open the box, first thing I have to mention to you guys is that the keyboard that you're gonna buy from Tempest will have a 12 month warranty and also additional 3 more months if you register with Tempest. This will then ensure your keyboard to be safe. So first off, the keyboard itself is at $149 for retail price and right now it's going through a promotion as I'm speaking right now at $129. Alright, so enough of me explaining. Let's step right into the unboxing part. Right here we have the packaging which has a sharp looking design which looks awesome and mentions the name of the keyboard which is Kirin that is named after a mythological beast that is known for swiftness and grace like an elder dragon. Behind the box shows the specification of the keyboard followed by their company QR code and certifications. Inside the box, we have first a Ziploc bag that consists of a Type-C cable for your keyboard. Next up, we have this unique keycap puller which not all keyboard package consists of. The thing I like about in the packaging is that there are two foams that clamps the keyboard in place. This prevents knocking off the keyboard when being delivered or being carried around. Lastly, we have the keyboard itself weighing about 1kg wrapped in a static bag and covered with a keyboard dust cover. If you are thinking if there's any manual in the box, answer is no, because in their website they upload the manual in PDF form, allowing buyers to read up when using, as I find it helpful due to how forgetful I am, and this saves me lots of trouble to find the physical copy of the manual then looking it up on their website. The keycap on the keyboard are deep dyed laser engraved and made out of PBT and ultra durable shine resistance which makes every keycap looking as if it was newly bought even after a rigorous usage. The design and arrangement color of the keycap enables me to notice the keys easier. For example, the function keys are in both orange and black and the typing keys are white in color, surrounded by control, alternate and enter keys etc with different colors. For a beginner typer, this keyboard is perfect as it is easy to see and notice the position of the keys. The keyboard backplate is made with SECC steel and casing with ABS plastic. The back of the keyboard has these foot pads that is anti-skid rubber to prevent the moving of the keyboard by leaning on it with your wrist or hands. The keyboard also have two tilt legs that enables 6 degree levitation from the table as it gives you a higher angled keyboard for comfort gaming. The Kirin's 10 keyless keyboard, meaning without the number pad, enables correct posture and reduces unnecessary strains on wrists and shoulders by offering more room for your arm to be rested in a natural centered position. For the key switches, they use gold standard Cherry MX switches which is German manufactured and withstood the test of time and are recognized as the industry standard for both gamers and typists worldwide. Also, if you are wondering what switches is this keyboard using, it is using the gold standard Cherry MX red switch. The switch has an actuation point of 45 grams which means it's softer to press on and 2 mm of actuation point followed by it is liner switch type meaning the quietest compared to brown and blue switch. This switch is used commonly for gamers who want fast action with minimum resistance. It is extremely portable as you can plug and play anywhere. As for setting up it's easy and fast free due to the detachable USB-C cable consisting in the package. Also the keyboard is wireless and uses Bluetooth 3.0 
and he has an onboard memory which allows users to connect and save up to 3 devices pairing simultaneously via Bluetooth. It is also Bluetooth compatible with Windows, Mac, iOS, and Android devices. The Kirin also has a rechargeable lithium battery capacity of 1850 mAh that can last you for 60 hours of wireless usage with a full charge of 5 hours. Therefore, without the cable, it is still possible for usage. Just ensure that your laptop or desktop have Bluetooth. The Kirin also comes with individual backlit white LED switches, allowing you to adjust the brightness of the LED lights and also able to toggle between 7 present light patterns. This is helpful as no software is needed to enable or change the light patterns. So, after a long talk about the specification part and the explaining, you must be thinking, how does the keyboard actually sound like? So here will be the footage of the keyboard typing sound. Enjoy! Alright guys, thank you so much for watching this video, hope this is useful for all the builders out there and a huge thank you to Tempus for sponsoring this video because without them, none of this would have been possible and also do show them some support and love because without love and support from you guys, they won't be asking me to make any more reviews so go down to their Instagram page or their Facebook page and type do send Joey more uh, keyboards to review on and send him more in the future something like that yeah and if you are new to this channel or want more contents like with me reviewing stuff please do hit the subscribe button below and comment what would you like to see in the next video and as always see you builders next time